Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be once again opening another Paldean Fates ETB. I had such a blast opening this last one and I wanted to get into the shiny vault a little bit more and spend some more time shiny hunting in game. Let's get into it. Okay, we have already covered what is in <laughs> the ETB. So instead of doing that, we're, just, we're frankly just going to get right into the pecs. I have also upgraded some sleeves here that are less terrible that I'll be using instead. Another daily Dallin. Let's get right into this. So again, we have nine packs in our standard ETB. Whatever shinies we pull, we will hunt for in game. Looking for, I mean, frankly, I'm looking for anything. I've kind of had this idea rolling around in the back of my head where maybe um, I start keeping track and see if I can get a living decks of all the shinies I haven't gotten. Ooh, Nimona looking nice. Not a shiny. Maybe we can shiny hunt Nimona. Not sure about that. But anytime I get a new game, I usually, you know, hunt for those Pineco, Lantern, Primate, Shmacot, Maractus. Ooh, that is a nice pull. Wochian is shiny locked, but I really, that blue looks so good. Let me get up closer to you guys on there. Loving the sparkle. I don't think there's a deck that can use this either, but frankly, it's so pretty. And I like the blue that I'm not even, <laughs> I'm not even mad. Two for two. We're two for two. Nothing to look for, but, but I do have a surprise up in uh, after opening these that will hopefully will rectify, will rectify any shinies or lack thereof from our ETB opening. Um, the set the set itself is pretty small in terms of repeat cards. A lot of these special sets are. I think there's only, yeah, if you look at the bottom here, there's only 91 cards in the set that aren't um, gonna be shiny. So so the odds, and we have three, we have basically three slots at the end of the pack, at the end of the pack to pretty much hit any of these. Ooh, Scrafty. <gasps> Ooh, Relor. <laughs> That's gonna be such a fun one to hunt. It's so easy. It stands out exciting looking forward to that ultra ball executor executor i've already pulled going after that dung baby gonna go after that dung baby okay where are we we are in the asada desert we're on top of a little hill i'm gonna be making a bug encounter sandwich to mostly isolate relor we're gonna see a couple larvesta and keep the upgraded timer and i'll see y'all when we get it the bug encounter sandwich it's just one cherry two Salty. That's gonna be the best way to do it, I think. Gonna get that dung, baby. Gonna get that dung, baby. Gonna get that real or shiny. It's gonna be a dung, baby. Gonna get that bug sandwich. Gonna get that dung, baby. Sparkling power, time power, dung, baby. I'm gonna rock picnic resets this time, I think. This this little cliff peak should give me what I need to see. Let's see. There's a real ore. There's a real ore. Unfortunately, Sandwich One did not net us a <laughs> shiny dung baby. Didn't get us a shiny dung baby. This is not focusing because I held it up really weird. Um, you know, this man. So uh usually, you know, pop down a save, reset it, save your Urban Mystica. I forgot. So this is what we're doing. I've done other stuff already. Sandwich time for our dung, baby. Gonna make that salty sandwich for huh? my dung, baby. Jerry Mato's on the bread, dung, baby. I got the dung, baby. I got my dung, baby. 46 minutes, save my game. Getting dung, baby, dung, baby. Okay, that it stands out so much. There was a sandstorm and it was nighttime. And I was like, there's no way I'm gonna see it. I see it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna love this one so much when I'm looking at it, and I'm like, this is a stunner. This is a stunner. I'm actually so excited. <laughs> I opened it and I felt like maybe I was a little disappointed, but now getting it in game. I wonder. I feel like I get. I don't know. I feel like I get a bigger rush <laughs> once I find it in game. Does Sandstorm hit the Relor? Okay. Um, it does, so we won't be using ball swipe. Now to find the perfect ball. We guess like golden. Or I guess like I guess it just has to be luxury ball. It just has to be the luxury ball. I'm not gonna ball swipe it. I'm not gonna ball swipe it. I did save like a grown-up, which is good. Oh. <laughs> he popped right out. Oh that so fast. Why would he do that? Stay in the ball. 
Not the sandstorm. Why do you live here if it hurts you? What? No. I just want my dung, baby. You wanna get my dung, baby? Getting cards to match on cards for my dung, baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. One down, one down. I know I've only opened nine packs on camera, but I have been making these little, these like ASMR shorts. If you guys like YouTube shorts, um, check them out where I just open some of the small stuff, like a tin or a little box um, or something like that. They're a lot of fun. I think they're pretty relaxing. Relaxing for me to do and make as well. Pikachu. I love this Pikachu. I think we're going to get frustrated by the end of looking at it. Oh my gosh. Banffy's so cute. So, so far we're three for three on the hits. Really love to see it. Rafty, Ultra Ball, Clive. Executor again, but reverse at least. Ghastly and one more. Oh, no. Not the there. <laughs> the positive. I thought maybe uh, the edges on these always get me, I feel like. Because the in the Paldean, Paldea new set, right? The newest one. All the edges shine where they didn't used to because they used to be the yellow. And anytime I see it, like peeking out, I'm like, oh, is this going to be? Is this the shiny for me? I think it might be. <laughs> uh, I don't know if you guys think that too. Let me know. Let me know if you've. Um, Baited yourself into thinking you were getting um, hits as well from from these sorts of things. Mankey, Curlia, Gengar, Nest Ball, I'm Junior Reverse, Charmander, and oh 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 no, just a just a regular Mimikyu. Nothing 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 too exciting. I have never master setted anything before. I think because I just like I enjoy casually opening, you know, having fun posting for you guys, but. I never, I never take the time to like really hunt them out or, or buy too much product or anything like that. And, and this, this might be the first set where I think I'm really incentivized to go out of my way to get all the shinies and keep them um, in a binder and just kind of like experience it. Moonlit Hill, Abro Traverse, Armorouge. Can we get another shot? Annihilate. Okay, okay, okay. We were, we were, we were three in a row and we hit one shiny, shiny. But again, I do, I do have a backup in mind if this does not work out I, I think we should we should get a few more at least we got we had three last time we opened an etb so hopefully we can at least get um three this time rare candy swoobat moonlit hill again i really like i really like just like the art on this card i don't know the reverse is really pretty hammer up this one too <gasps> rapska the evolution of relor okay okay two so we'll get two there interesting rolls and they'll be the same area so fun hunt looking for two i got the other one so fast look how fast it was it just uh... <laughs> <laughs> I love getting this one. This might be my favorite one I've gotten so far. Look at it. Look at it. Look at that dung, baby. Look at that dung, baby. It's going to grow up and be a gem, baby. Hey, number two. Number two. It's time to go on our walk. I took a walk. Do, 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 I'll see y'all in a thousand steps. Roll, dung baby, roll. Oh, <laughs> it was enough. Time for our Repska. <laughs> I just finished my coffee. I think it's in the other side. But hey, oh, it's got the gold body. Sheesh. This is a, this is a good looking one. And back to the living decks of shinies. That's gonna work. I think we're gonna, I'm gonna take some time, make spreadsheet. Look at what I already got and then start tracking and start getting into it. It's a big hunt or it, it, I, I don't expect to get very far into it at all, but I do expect to start making some progress with these videos as I open stuff and just do various different types of challenges like that. It'll just be fun for me to keep track. Nest Ball, Bridgebacks Reverse, Mankey and a room. Okay, last one. Decent amount of hits, four hits. I think that's the same I got last time. Lean, leaning a little low. I do really like that Wochian and the Nimona as well. So can't complain. Candomouse, I can complain that I don't get the shinies that I want, actually. Maractus, Atticus, Dawn Fan, Nimona's Backpack. If I can open these, Graveyard Reverse, Charcadet, and Fortress EX. It's, it is not a shiny, but maybe we'll. Maybe we'll play it and look for those. Okay, now that we've got the two we've gotten from our ETB, it's time to move into that special portion of the video where I have pulled some 
cards, not offline, but I pulled them in little shorts. So all these cards will be in little shorts that are either on the YouTube channel or also on the TikTok. All the links are down below. Um, if you like a little ASMR, a little card opening, different vibe. Um, that's why I've done that. When I, if I just go out and do errands, sometimes I just like grab a pack and that's, and I won't want to do a whole video, but I'll still want to like do something with it. And that is how I have these four buddies. We've got Gardevoir, Kaleffa, Claude Sire, and Palafin. I think I'm gonna start with Kaleffa. Crystal Pool and Kitakami. First things first, you're gonna walk around for a bit. Back in through here, there's a little cave. Okay, okay. And then you can just wee. <laughs> you just fall right in. Okay. And now that we're in here, um, there's a pretty decent like Cleffa Clefairy spawn. Sandwich time. Got him. Got him. I messed up that sandwich a couple times, so that's why we have a little blip in the timer. <laughs> Wait, well, mm. I don't know if that was t I enjoyed it face or not. There it is. There it is. <laughs> I forgot to unmute my mic when I recorded this section. I got the clever with the greeners in the cave over in Kitakami. Please forgive me for not knowing how to use my setup. Yeah. Wah, wah. We did not get another one with the rest of that sandwich, but that is all right. That just means we can move right along on down the river to Palafin. <laughs> Let's go. I think I might just try my hand at um a little outbreak for Palatine. I might try my hand just to, you know, knocking him out 60 and seeing and going from there. What I think I am going to do is still set up a water sparkling power sandwich, but try to avoid the encounter sandwich because I don't need the encounter anymore and it's water. So I think I'm just going to go for the sparkling power. Two cucumber green yellow red two like sour Ooh, okay i made an encounter anyways it's fine that's I'm not gonna worry about it too much <laughs> and we got it it didn't take too too long and i ran into the magic carpet but there's our venison right there uh this one took a bit, a bit longer than the other ones i will say but i am so excited it wasn't letting me stay with And that's why you say. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I love the purple color on it. It looks so good. I'm so tempted to actually use a master ball on this one. We'll take a look. We'll take a look and see what else I know. <laughs> I have one. I'm down to be chaotic and do it. I think it's fun. I think it's a good shiny dive. Mm, dive ball would be good too, but that's more of like a blue. Palafin, Palafin has more blue to him. Let's use, let's use the dive ball on this one. And then the next time I can, when I keep it, if I keep it, I'll use the last ball on it. I have felt a little stressed when we didn't get it, even though I saved right in front of it, but we got it now. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> but before we go get Gardevoir, we need to visit our friend and evolve our Palafin into a Venison. Okay, setting up for the Gardevoir hunt, um, we are going to do a fairy type sandwich. And frankly, if you just like make your way through the mountain, Gardevoir will spawn with little worlds around it. So either or would be great. Um, yeah, and we're just going to walk through the mountain with the fairy sandwich active. Here we can see, you know, just these groups of, of worlds and Gardevoir should be pretty, pretty straightforward huh, overall. How fast was that? Three minutes? In less than three minutes, we have this shiny guard bar already. I'm definitely going to spend the rest of this time on the sandwich still looking for the other ones, though. 
um just to get the full line but that just goes to show you how quick how quick this one can really be a shiny guard or something um you're interested in getting too this is something i've wanted for a while on it and i just never went out of my way to get it i'm glad i did i love the blue i love guard of war gen 3 ride or die for sure mm, great ball would be good I th i'm still just surprised how fast it was <laughs> Uh. Hey, and that's the that is the guard of war already i'm gonna spend the rest of the sandwich time um going up and down the mountain just to see what else i can get hopefully a rolls and um honestly hopefully three rolls <laughs> that would be what i want i got another roll i just want this roll and it's so shiny i love it i'm gonna save my game hey that's two with one sandwich this roll hunt is very chill i definitely recommend it I'm thrilled we managed to get two different rolls off of that sandwich down this mountain hunt. And with that in mind, we can move on to our very last one, Cloud Sire. Due to some technical difficulties on my side, the timer is now reset for the Cloud Sire hunt. But nonetheless, we are sitting at South Providence Area 6, right outside of the Leaky Tower of Paldea. Um, if you see down here, there's quite a few spawns in the water. I'm not seeing any Paldean ones right now, or Whooper or Cloud Sire, but basically they spawn in little packs. And we're going to set up a poison type sandwich and do some hunting and respawning right through here. I was having a ton of problems like identifying those spot and boopers from that last spot so i've decided to check out a different area make sure it's daytime so the colors can be a little bit clearer and hopefully i'll have a little bit better time i'm gonna try to go over in south providence and these big ponds right here also to be able to get the same isolated spawn with the poison counter sandwich and we can see this area has a ton of a ton of Palde and whooper spawning in the water specifically and around it and during the daytime you can see it a lot better this big one's got the most by a lot I was looking for it's like a lot bluer it's a lot the little side face things are kind of an orangey color picnic resetting until I find what I need I had to cut the Paldean Wooper hunt a little bit short in the evening due to some dinner plans but that didn't stop me from making one more sandwich on the Uber right over where I managed to snag it and last but not least to evolve the Paldean Wooper into Claude Sire I got the dung, baby. I got my dung, baby. 